Okay, so, um, hi guys, and today we're gonna be seeing how to, um, uh, create your own Minecraft server with plugins, um, like this, that allow you to do stuff like this, which I, um, programmed with, like, um, the tutorial. pretty cool. It just launches you around. Um, but that's not the purpose of this video. What? What? Is it lagging? Oh, okay, it's really lagging. Oh god, it's so laggy. Yeah, so server oh might lag depending on how fast your computer is but um yeah i don't know why it's so laggy i'll turn off shaders turn to it Bigot 1.16.1 uh, on getbucket.org uh, Wait, did the server just crash? Okay, yeah, whatever. Um, so you download you download this. Um, and then we um up um start dot bat code which is uh i believe um it's this uh so then we, we we're gonna go onto our desktop create a new new Folder, let's name it like Spigot Server the third because I have two other ones. Um, so we'll go to Spigot Server the third. I know first have to uh, go to uh, downloads. There it is. Control C. Let's do the third. Do the third. Um, and then paste that into there. So now we will create a test document. Name it start dot bat. Yes. Um, okay, so once we start dot bat, we will edit it. Um, paste the code. Oh yeah, it is. Um, paste the code, change that to spigot one point one spigot dash one point sixteen point one dot jar. Save it. And then we're going to go to a start dot. Oh yeah, I should probably close out my other server first. Start dot bat, run it. And then it, for some reason it always says that, although we're using, you, we are using the correct version of spigot. So we're just going to have to wait 20 seconds. Um, yeah, it's really annoying. But... So we just wait for it to load.
Um, I did have to re restart it one t once for some reason. Um, so now that um, we started it once, and we're going to go to eula.txt, change that to true. Um, that will that will make it um, that will tell that you agreed to Minecraft EULA. So then you will um, start the server again and then wait. It's gonna take a long time to generate the world. But once it's generated, then it's basically done. It's not done yet. You still have to do the port forwarding, but it's almost done. Back, um, now it says done. Um, that's good. So then we will go to click on direct connection or on a server, it doesn't matter. Type in localhost and then join the server. Um, and you might want to op yourself. Op JPC boy and then slash game mode creative just for, you know, like doing stuff. Um, so then now that our server works, it's almost done, but just one more, just one more very complicated step. Um, I don't exactly, um, like, uh, I can't, it, it's not a thing for all devices, cause, um, but yeah, we need to port forward it. So the port forwarding, uh, if we want to port forward it, then we're going to have to, um, if you, if port forwarding requires you to search up, like, how to port forward for your, your router, because it's not routers, but, um, so, port forward the port 255, 25565, um, on both UTP and TCP, um, and then um, on your, for your IP address. So that other people can um, play on your server. So then after that, um, you still probably, other people still probably can't connect to your server. And the reason is, why is because of the firewall. So, um, so to solve the firewall issue, go to search up Windows Defender Firewall, go to um, allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall, and then we go to um, change settings, and you see um, we get, we check every Java TM platform SE binary one, um, oops, okay, wait, no, it's Java W, it doesn't matter, um, so we check all of them in private and public, and then check this thing too, so then we click on OK, um, and then you should be able to, um, connect with other Custom plugin. You just need to uh, go to like spigot uh, plugin, um, and then you click on like tool. I just well, you click on just search up resources 
and then basically you can find all these and then um once you download them uh then you can go to your file explorer and drag them into the plugins folder so yeah it's about it um And yeah, so uh, also if you want to f give other people your i your your server address, you search up my IP on Google, and then it'll show like this, something like that. So everyone, we can um, connect to this instead of localhost. It should still work. I think, um, yeah, um, also I'll put the link to the resource back in the description, it's, um, 128 pixels.